And now we're going to talk about types of white wines. Again, white wines, the styles are, di are dictated by the regions they come from. Um, I start off with my favourite region, which is Burgundy. Burgundy wines, mainly Chardonnay. Um, in France, they rarely label the wine, certainly the Burgundy people rarely label the wine by the grape variety on there. They will label the wine by the village from which it comes from. But if you're getting a Burgundy, it's normally a Chardonnay. There is enough chance that you may be buying a Bourgogne Alligote, which is the second white wine variety from that region. They make lovely, delicate style wines to, from Chablis all the way through to expensive wines that are richer and more, more powerful. Um, Saint Aubin is an example, Poligny Montrachet is another example. So Burgundy is the first name you'll come across. They often use the word Bourgogne on the bottle and then you have the village name from which the wine comes from, in this case Saint Aubin, and in this case um, Chablis. Now when you buy your wines, when you're looking for white wine, again, it's, they come in varieties, varietal wines like Sauvignon, Chardonnay, uh, Riesling, Pinot Grigio. So you can buy um, wines by variety, um, and the white wines come in single grape varieties. Some wines actually blended, Samillon Sauvignon, you'll get from Bordeaux and from the Hunter Valley in Australia. That's a typical example of a blended white wine. But in the main, white wines appear these days to be mainly single varietals. Um, if you're looking at the style of wine you want, um, geographically, areas like Chile and Argentina produce simple, light, um, sometimes you can get a bit more richness in them, but fairly easy drinking wines. Um, Italy, very food friendly wines, um, so they maybe show more acidity and, in, and more intense flavour profiles. Um, if you go to Australia for something like a Chardonnay, here typically an Australian Chardonnay from Adelaide Hills, you would be getting often very intense Chardonnay with more oak in it. But the thing about oak in white wine is don't shy away from it. What is very important about white wine is balance, the balance between the fruit, the acidity, and any other ingredient like the oak. As long as they're in balance, they make a great wine to have. Um, and in this case for Australian wines, I expect more richness to come out, more fruits to come out. Something like a Burgundy, I expect not just intense fruit, more complexity, minerality, a range of flavours coming through there. Um, Riesling, as well as um, Gewestramina and Pinot Gris, you tend to find these wines in the longer bottles um, being made um, in Germany, north of France. You may get one or two from Italy. Um, this happens to be an Australian example and New Zealand are also making great Rieslings as well. They're light, they can be off dry or bone dry. So you need to be careful with these sort of wines. If you like a very dry wine, make sure you ask your wine merchant for, for a bone dry wine. And that applies across the board. Some wines like Sauvignon are considered very dry, with Chardonnays are slightly softer. Um, but not off dry. Another wine which, a white wine which comes across as sweet is a Chenin Blanc. You can buy Chenin from the Loire area. Chenin will have anything from an off dry taste to bone dry taste. You can also have it almost to dessert sweetness, but it's still a wine to be used within your, with food or sipping. These are just some of the examples of white wines. There are hundreds, literally hundreds of white wine grape varieties and it's just where your adventure takes you. You could do the ordinary wines like Pinot Grigio and Chardonnay Sauvignon or you could do wines Riesling, Gevis Tremina, slightly more uh, exotic for us or something like a Pinot Gris from, from the Oregon Valley. Um, so just keep your mind open Try as many different white wine varieties as possible. Find what your favorites are, and then also find the best wine varieties for the types of food you like. And then you will have a great enjoyment experience with the different styles of wine.